Hello, people of the internet. My name is Mia Cotton, and welcome back to Pizza Game. We are in the middle of about to make a very extremely important decision. Oh my god, this game is ruining my sense of being able to speak. Then again, I really couldn't speak before, but that is beside the point. We had to make a decision about what to do. Are we going to be a loser? Or are we going to stop Sensei from winking? I don't know if that's the same choice, but we have a very important decision to make, so let's make this choice! Listen to Lamp, help Sensei. Am I going to listen to Lamp or help Sensi? Uh... I don't really like Lamp. I'm gonna help Sensei. That's right! I can never let Sensi explode like that! He trusted me as a friend and a student. Plus, think about everybody in the classroom. I've made so many friends at school this year. What? I can't let everybody down. We made a promise to be best friends forever. No, no you didn't. I made my choice. Just a few more weeks, class. Oh! Sensi! <laughs> okay, okay, am I narrating this out loud? I jumped into the air in a high five and landed on Sensei, tackling him toward the ground right before he went to the final wink in the wink meter. It was a good thing I was in the Olympics, I thought proudly. I am my original character. <laughs> Whoa! Nice going, Kayan. You saved us from a nasty disorder. Disaster. <laughs> Far by name is a hero! Hurrah! Don't have enough budget to finish this character's line, sorry. <laughs> I know I made the right choice at saving Sensei. Aw, Sensei! Oh, he's sad. Oh, no. Sensei, his teeth are weird. <laughs> That's the thing I notice. But when he get it up, he was a sad face on his face. And suddenly, I wasn't so sure. Just then, Sensei started to cry. Why, student person? Oh, boy, here it comes. Why would you do that? I was about to almost a world recorder, and now it ruined. Way to go, Kayan, you ruined it. Oh, fuck you, Warp Slam. You're the one who encouraged me in the first place. But... You really should have listened to your good old me, Lamp. The, you, though, actually, a sensei, sensei being total devastation right now was probably the most twisted outcome. In a way, you might be even more twisted than me. Aw, I got the approval of the Warp Lamp. That's lame. Shut up, Lamp! You're just too much baby to admit I saved everyone. What, lol? <laughs> he did enough of that, I'm not reading that. <laughs> Jesus Christ, he's still going. I don't know if my eyeball- I don't know if my eyeballs will ever stop crying! Hey, Sensei! Yes? Oh. This isn't the Wisconsin Dell, Sensei. Can you maybe take your water work somewhere that isn't my 50-foot vicinity? Anybody from Wisconsin tell me if that's accurate. Wisconsin. You're spewing mucus everywhere. Oh, that's not from crying. That's just my glands. I don't like the way he italicized that. But you're right. I don't think I could do the rest of class in this condition. The rest would imply that you spent the last 10 minutes doing anything class-related at all. Here's your substitute teacher. Please pay attention and do him a respect, guys. I'm off to collect the pieces of my shattered dreams. <gasps> Cry. Sensei. Do you think I'll be alright? Oh, I'm, I'm kind of sad. I made him sad. Oh, oh, there's suddenly Halloween decorations. I didn't even notice that. I like the little ghost on the chalkboard. Don't forget your books. I kind of want that on a, on a pin. No. Who cares? This is a chance our sub is a hottie. I think we all deserve a second chance saying how he, we've all had to suffer through Sensei's face these past two days. You guys you aren't very sensitive. Him <laughs> him. Settle down, class. Settle down, please. Fingers crossed for magazine model. Oh, who in oh. who are hell are you? <laughs> Hello. Mm. 
Who is this chicken on a stick? <laughs> Quieted the peanut gallery. It is time for a begin class. I will be your professor instructor. Sav. First off, there is an announcement. Due to a scheduling conflict, the driver's ed class will be held at 9 a.m. from now on. 9 a.m.? Well, time to drop out. What scheduling conflict could there possibly be? As you know, Dia de los Muertos begins tomorrow. The administration did not want to risk holding night classes as this might coincide with the Muertos rising from the grave. What? Personality, I don't see what's wrong with a little challenge. Anyway, enough chat chat. Your teacher left me some instructions here. However, there was far too many team activities planned for today, in my personal opinion. Teamwork is garbage. Ooh, you're a fun emo boy, aren't you? You're one of those, like, you're a Magane character and I can't even see your eyes because you're so mysterious and emo! But the flower on your shirt lets me know that you're a little bit sensitive. Is he a romantic interest? He might be. I think he is. He's, he's a named character. Instead, I have fastened this instructions into a little hat. <laughs> he's got a little hat. Now then, let's begin today's school lesson by opening your textbooks to page 27. Textbook? What textbook? I don't know, you're the one who signed up for this dumb class, not me. Lam, can I borrow your textbook? Um. What do I look like? An apple tree under a witch curse that drops books instead of apple? A little bit, yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah, well, I don't have a book, obviously. Only nerds buy textbooks, Cayenne. It's a total scam con art artist industry, and, uh, and you're a loser for even suggesting it. Also, what textbook? Is there a problem back there? Yeah, actually, Cayenne was just saying how much you look like a loser who eat toenail for breakfast. Wow, you are a dick. You probably write on dating websites like, ooh, I love dogs, so girls think you mean a cool dog when it's actually just a dachshund. Hey, uh, hang on. Dachshunds are adorable, you asshole. <laughs> Leave dachshunds out of this. <laughs> you are officially on my shit list, warp lamp. Nobody shit talks dachshunds in my let's plays. Lamp! Wait, what's a dachshund? Cayenne, sweetie. It's one of those dogs you dress up as a hot dog for Halloween. Oh, lol. It's two dachshunds and how dare you. Yeah, I'll blame Cayenne, teacher guy, not me. As you can see, she's about 60% water, 80% carbon, and 100% vitriol. That doesn't add up. What? What? No, I'm not. I'm at least 60% princess, too. Everybody in this school is bad at math. <laughs> God. I'll assume Cayenne is the female standing next to you. Oh, he says female. I hope this is the one and only time he says it, because I have a soft spot for nerds, but if you say female in casual conversation, I immediately go like, bleh. Cayenne, is this true? Did you make fun of my dachshunds? I would never do such a thing. No, teacher. Lamb is just making stuff up because he doesn't have a textbook and jealous because I'm such a perfect student. Cayenne, what the fuck? Are, are you writing me out? Why are you writing me out? I'm so angry. No textbook. I see. This is a problem. Shit looks like I'm a fugitive noir. In that case, you may borrow this manuscript of my upcoming novel and pretend to read along with the class. Good God. When you really are just reading my amazing work in my humble opinion. Oh God, he's one of these people. Bagel brain. Bagel brain. Wow, that is an in <laughs> that is an insult. I'm gonna start using that. Psh, why would I want to read a novel written by some bagel brain like you? You have glasses and you have a lamp on your head. Are you even wearing pants? I think I can see him wearing pants, but I don't know if he's wearing pants. 
Case closed. Warplamp once again. But I like my glasses, and I need them to see. Dick. Yeah, sorry, no, they're bad. In that case, I am unafraid to inform you that I have a zero-tolerance policy with regards to you, and will be forced to make an example of you in front of class. No hard feelings, friend, but I must banish you to the dark place. What? What? What had to happen? What? What? <laughs> what the shit just happened? What, ju what the fuck just happened? Goodbye. He just banished Lamb. Oh my god. This is so weird. What is happening? Oh crap. We're probably next. The next person to insult my magnum opus and or glasses will be turned into a second tiny hat. I don't want to be turned into a second tiny hat. But do you, but like if you turn another student into a second tiny hat, can I can I have the hat? Can I can I have the second tiny hat? Now. Then, I just glad <laughs> I love the squeaking noise. Today's chapter lesson is on road signs. Who can give me an example of a road sign? Dosh, it's crossing. Oh, what a good example. We've got to get out of here, enemy. More like it, you've got to get out of here because I am not a physical entity and social rules do not apply to me. Sometimes you might see a dachshund near the road, but with such a sign, you will, you will surely remember to not hit it. All right, I've got a plan. Yes? Here. There's Pyokas in my phone, I don't like it! You grab my cell phone and claw me from the outside the room, but pretend to be my mom with a family emergency. Then, I'll pick up the cell phone and say I have to leave. Wait, hold on, then I won't have my cell phone. Okay, so you can call me on my cell phone and then hand it back to me so I can- Ah, uh, I didn't even get a chance to read every day! Cayenne. Gulp! Since you're so eager to have a chat for station back there, why don't you tell us what color this hypothetical dachshund sign would be if you were to see it on the road? Uh, uh... I have to pee! We have that- <laughs> And I'm gone. Well, that was easy. Can I leave now? Can I go home? Phew, that was close. Smooth, girl. Totally smooth. Thanks. Sure. Oh my god, why are you here? What a weird day of class, I mean. Lamp? What are you doing here? I thought you were banished. Yeah, it turns out the dark place is just the community center bathroom. Which makes sense. Well, I was about to have an integral dialogue, so could you please leave the girls' bathroom? Psh, I can't just leave. It's detention. No, it's not. You are... You can leave. Anytime you... And besides, aren't you supposed to be the rebellious one? Where's your rebel spirit, man? Why did I snap? Nobody could see me do the, like, the full arc snap thing. <laughs> I added it for emphasis. I'll get even... I'll get it even deeper shit if I just bail. Deeper shit. I get it. Because bathroom. Lamp, aren't you like the class delinquent? Blowing off detention would be totally your thing. Thank you, Cayenne, who was being smart for once in her stupid life. Oh yeah. Oh hey, yeah, I guess you're right. Looks like I'll be seeing you later. I won't like it, but I will still happen done regardless. Later, loser juice. Yeah, bye. Psh, loser juice. The juice that power nerds' cars, probably. You can tell it's a nerd car because they're the ones that have bumper stick on them, like, with, like, chemistry joke and a reference to some guy's death date. 1886. Quit mumbling and leave already! What? Oh yeah, sure, whatever. We died that year, was it, like, Alexander Graham Bell? <laughs> okay, bye, warped lamp. <laughs> See, we're, we're helping him become the person he knows that he needs to be. Where, I don't know why, I'm kind of getting attached to Warped Lamp. The, this this always happens. I always get attached to, like, to, like, I say, I wanted to see the derp characters, but, like, every single character in this game is a derp character. Warped Lamp is just the crazy derp character. Like Oko-san in Had a Full Boyfriend, which I will be getting back to at some point. I just, I have other shit lined up before that. <laughs> Alright, Lamp is finally gone.
<laughs> now I can talk out loud to myself and I won't feel like a weirdo. Wait, I'm still here to hear. What? Huh? When did you get here? Go away. Yeah, but you're an unnamed minor character. Mm. Aww. <laughs> I ship Kayam with student 156. <laughs> Look that up on AO3. Man, Sensei seemed pretty upset when I helped stop the wink meter. He must not have known of the terrible danger he was putting us through. I'm sure you did the right thing, girlfriend. Whatever. I don't care. I'm just your inner monologue. Me too. Deep down in my inside heart place conscious, I know I did a good thing to have Sensei will thank me one day. Conscious. <gasps> Mr. Aramnase is here. Why is he in the community center bathroom? And why is there like a, a boat door wheel thing on the inside of this bathroom door? And why am I? Oh, sorry. The bathroom door. I'm in the bathroom. <laughs> I know what happens in Rome bathhouses. I'm, I, I don't know where I was going with that. Let's get back to Mr. Aramnes, our favorite attractive murderer. Conscious. What? Ah! Where are your legs? Where did your legs go? The word is conscience. You spelled it conscious. How can you read my dialogue? He's breaking the fourth wall. That's the typo, you correct? Mr. Aramnes, get out of here! I'm trying to have a monologue. Oh. <laughs> I apologize. I didn't know I was interrupting a meeting of the mind. <gasps> He's blushing. <gasps> I think he likes me. Ooh. Yeah, well, you were, so. That, no, that's me. Well, yeah, you were, so. I'll be on my way then. Okay, bye. Some people have no respect. Now I totally toasted my train of thought and you chased him away. Where did he go? He ascended into the sky without legs. Yeah, that was pretty rude from what I heard inside the stall. Let's go home, Inner Me. I'm sure Sensei will be better by tomorrow. Yeah. Well, home sweet home. That was much more mentally taxation than I expected. There was a minimal amount of sensei today, so I'm satisfied. What do you have against sensei? Why are you so- He's weirdly proportioned, but he's a good person on the inside. I could just tell. He's an innocent soul. Aw, oh, man. I've only been up for like three hours, and I am already want to go to bed sleep again. Mood. He Here's Johnny. Movie reference. I <laughs> get it like the movie. Swoo! The movie is the shigginging, by the way. <laughs> Where did the pronunciation came from? I couldn't. I don't even think I could repeat that. Oh. What's wrong, Kyan? It's Halloween. Oh yeah, I forgot that it's Halloween. See, at least we get a Halloween episode from this. Had a full boyfriend. Looking at you. Where's our Halloween birds? I know they celebrate Halloween in Japan. What, did birds outlaw Halloween? Anyway. Turn that frown into a smile or else Halloween Santa won't give you your present. <laughs> oh, I didn't forget it that it was even Halloween. What? I didn't I forget it it was even... Did I forget or anything? Did I forget or did I not forget? Did we get any trick-or-treaters? If you... I didn't have any candy though, so I gave out some of your old magazines and spoonfuls of ice cream. And then I ran out of those, so I gave out the fine china you had in the cabinet, remember, from when your uncle died? Wow, Johnny, you are a dick bag. I hope that's okay, it wasn't ideal, but I didn't want to ruin a child's Halloween or something, that would be kind of a bummer. <gasps> Actually, now that I think of it, it was more than a few trick-or-treaters, wasn't it? You gave out all my magazines? Johnny, I collect those! Why, it's not like a spring 2005 edition of Seventeen is valuable or anything. There are pictures of boy in them! That has infinity values to me and you wouldn't understand it, Johnny! I guess I don't care about my uncle's china because I only care about boy! I majored in boy! Dang it! Yeah, I guess I don't. I mean, why look at a picture boy in a magazine when there is a boy right here? I got all the parts of a boy anyone might be interested in. Cowper's gland? The ghostly suggestion of a mustache? Whoops, I don't remember anything else from health class. All the parts, really. Is Johnny hitting on me? Is he doing a very bad job of hitting on me? 
Why am I enjoying this attention? Johnny's weird and he just gave away all my shit. Ta-da. Please download the Johnny Rope DLC for $5.99. Thank God damn it. No one would pay that much money to date you, Johnny. That's ridiculous because it's a great offer. Anyway, hey, wanna watch a scary movie for Halloween? -y? Like what? Like zombies of the at of the attack too. <laughs> Don't worry, sequels are scary. They have them far less quality than the originals, except in rare circumstances. Like Adam Stanley Values. I don't know why that's the first one that came to mind, but Adam Stanley Values is way better than the first Adam Stanley movie. Go watch it if you haven't. Just plugging Adam's family. <laughs> Fine then. What do you want to watch? Bubble twist in the spooky theater. What is that? Some kind of baby film? For cinephiles, each two, zero to two, who are too unappreciated to watch a zombie film? No, it's the Bubble Twist Halloween TV movie. No way, TV movies are scary! They have much less production quality than released to theater movies. Except when they don't. I can't think of an example right now, but you know what I mean. Then what are we going to watch? Are we going to watch Telephone, or is that my mom? Oh, it's your mom. I will answer it. Hello, Mommy? <laughs> Boo! Ah! And that went on for 20 minutes. <laughs> oh, it's just a Halloween prank, sweetie. Ghosts and goblins to you. Or whatever the Halloween greeting is. Uh, I think it's just Happy Halloween. Oh. That explains why I never got any candy as a child. I'm very repressed. And I've been passing it on to you for years. Sorry about that. We don't have therapy in Floor Daddle. So what spooky shenanigans did you get up to? I made my teacher cry. Well, I didn't wake up until around 7 p.m., so not many spooky shenanigans. Snenan- sorry. Sorry, spooky snenanigans. I meant snenanigans. Is that a Halloween prank? No. Honey, you're going to lose your job. Already did, thanks. I did go to driver's ed, though. Except we didn't get much done because Sensei, our teacher, was trying to wink a bunch. What? He wanted to break the world record for most consecutive winks. I don't think that's a real record, honey. Yeah, it probably isn't. Anyway, I had to stop him before he winked too many or else he'd fill up the wink meter and blow up the whole school. Good job, honey. You're a hero. Yeah, except only since he got real sad about it and like he ran out of the room crying. Well, some people have their opinions, sweaty. Oh, God. Oh, wait. I didn't even notice there's a thing while you were out. Sensei of Learn Place. Inappropriate to give a student. What? Am I getting messages? Who's sending me messages? Is Johnny recording messages for me? Anyway. What matters is what's in your heart. Blood. <laughs> I didn't mean literally. Then after that, we had a student substitute teacher who was really mean and scary. He banished Lamp to the dark place, which turned out to be the bathroom. Then I yelled at Lamp a bit, and he came home where Johnny was being a real annoying about Halloween. What was he doing? Did he Halloween prank you? Yeah, but he also didn't have candy and gift out to trick-or-treaters, so he used my old magazines. The cat fancies? No, my old tissues of 17! My old issues of 17. Oh my god, I cannot read! My goodness, that's horrible! Why didn't he just give them Uncle Delantine China? Don't you have all that still sitting around? Oh no, he gave that out too. Well, good. Boy, I'm getting pretty worked up here. I need to calm down and watch my late night talk shows with the Jimmy Kimmel and all those types. I'm going to hang up now. I'll talk to you later. Bye, Mom. Bye, Ka Bye Ki Kyan. Holy God. Drake and Josh. What a nice lady. She seemed to be in a gooder mood than usual. Phew. I'm tired. It's time to hit the haystack. But you've only been awake for, like, four fours. Yeah, but come on, I'm tired. Read lazy. Ooh, cool down! Ow! Ow! God. I'm going to ignore that incredibly rude comment and go to sleepers. Good night, Intervene. Yeah. 
Good night, you. Uh, what, are we gonna watch a movie or? Johnny, go to bed. Okay. Aw. Mm, load screen. Artificial self basic of the game. Oh god. Okay. So that is going to have to be it for today. Oh my god. <laughs> There was so much weird shit that happened. Unlike every other episode, there's always weird shit happening in this game. But, oh god, we're going on to day three, and hopefully we'll actually get to spend some time that's not in a bathroom with Mr. Aramnes and his lack of legs. So thank you everybody so much for watching. Quick reminder that I post new videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 12 p.m. Pacific time. If you're interested in keeping up with the series that I play, you can click the subscribe button down below. I have all the links to my social medias and stuff, so you can follow me down there. And I will see you next time. Peace. Peace.